Okay, I think I've got another sub. Okay, I'm gonna get. If I get four in the grave again, five in the grave again, I've got two other sub darks. Yes, I've got two. I've got two sub darks in the grave. Well, out. And are you gonna let me do the plays this time, or are you gonna surrender? I've got five again, by the way. <laughs> All right, Nash. Are you ready for this? If you had imp, um, that would have been annoying. <laughs> He's coughing. I've got five in the grave, though. Ah, you can do it in the first time. I need at least two thousand. Right now we can now you can see too. And you're wondering how am I going to summon two? Well, I've got an idea. Well, to be fair, I actually, I actually want to see you beat two of these. And we're not done. Guess what? Now we can summon another one. That's not what happens now, right? So the end dragon, equip. Sacrifice to summon another one. I would have done this last door too, but you surrendered. I think there were two of them, I don't know. I literally had this play twice now. You're lucky I didn't. Br um, you're lucky I couldn't union carry though, because you wouldn't be able to use the extra deck at all. What card? If it's for Geki, no. See. Droplet doesn't work either, so you have to get rid of it. You have, to, you have to get rid of a 5,000 attack monster. Then you've got to get rid of two of them too, so... So basically, every active effect, so, it, so it's unaffected to Imperm, it's unaffected to uh, Droplet. So basically, if you have a monster that's like, if you have a, what is it? What is that card they always use for super polymerization? Oh yes, yeah, Starving Venom Dragon. If you have that, that that could take out Cyber Duck End. To be honest, I kind of want the Starving Venom Dragon, but I need, I need to use a Super Poly. Yeah, it's a good card. 
some guy starving Venom Dragon my uh, um, Cyber Dark End. Maybe Sniper could be it. Yeah, maybe Sniper could be it. Well, you're at least I'll have an Ash Blossom. Yeah, you, yeah, you let me go first, and uh, if I've got a good ass hand and you have no Ash Blossoms, I can bring out Cyber Dark End Dragons in the first time. I should have told you that. If I would, if I would have gone second, it would have been a lot harder for me to get these out. Because I have to deal with your back row, whatever you have. And you know what else? Max C is useless against this deck because you only special summon twice. Uh, people love to max C. Well, I've also got something else too. Like, if you don't do anything, it's OTK. But if you have Magic Cylinder, I'm dead. Oh, what is that other card like, uh, Magic Cylinder? A dimensional wall. I started using Dimensional Wall in that event. But basically, how I won easily, I was using the Cyber Dark, Cyber Dragon type of deck. Every time I got Nast up, I went straight into Power Bond and just Power Bonded the um, Rampage Dragon Power Bond. But every time they got every time they got Effect Vela or something else, I was like, surrender. Ugh. Like if that if that's an if that's an imperm or effect villa, really, yeah, I'm dead. But of course, effect villa is kind of useless if you special summon a monster over the card it targets. I think I, I think I haven't summoned two against you before. I think I only summoned one. Okay, I win. Yeah, I win. Oh, you know how I win too? Hold on. Check this out. Oh wait, it's not my turn yet. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, you bring out what is it? So every time you, re every turn you recycle. That's interesting, but I don't think it's enough because it's over. Ten thousand attack. <laughs> <laughs> 